PCOO Secretary Herminio Coloma reiterates that the country is already geared up for the ASEAN integration in 2015. Coloma added the ASEAN integration will bring the Philippines to greater heights. More from Sweden, Velado. Various representatives from local government units, diplomatic corps, and universities participated in the 47th anniversary celebration of the Association of Southeast Asian Nations, or ASEAN, that consists of Indonesia, Malaysia, Thailand, Singapore, Vietnam, Myanmar, Cambodia, Laos, Brunei, and Philippines. In the last five months before the ASEAN integration 2015, PCOO Secretary Herminio San Nicoloma Jr. emphasized in his keynote speech that the Philippines got what it takes to compete in the global arena. Coloma also reiterated that our country is already geared up for the ASEAN integration. If we follow the scorecard of the Department of Foreign Affairs as early as two years ago, we were already almost at 80% in terms of meeting all of our commitments on ASEAN economic integration. The PCOO secretary stated that the Aquino administration continues to find ways to promote awareness of one ASEAN community to Filipinos. In all the three pillars, not just economic but political security as well as socio-cultural, the Philippines is well poised not to take its place and to be very competitive and very active in promoting ASEAN economic integration. Meanwhile, Coloma shared the implication of ASEAN integration to maritime dispute between Philippines and China over West Philippine Sea. Well, ASEAN is one of the venues for achieving a peaceful and diplomatic settlement of all the maritime entitlement claims. That's why President Aquino has taken the lead to promote the fleshing out of the Code of Conduct. The government is positive that the ASEAN integration will bring our country to greater heights, especially now that the Philippines' rate on global competitiveness and ease of doing business moved up. For People's Television, this is Sweden Velado.